Hey, this is Ellie from Magic Beans, and in this video, I'm going to be comparing the Cybex Koya with other popular lightweight strollers. Now, this is going to be a very quick review. We're going to go very high level of the differences, um, but you should definitely check out the my best travel strollers, travel lightweight strollers of 2023 video, where I do a way more comprehensive review of all of the strollers or most of the strollers shown in this video. So here is the Koya. So um, this just came in to Magic Beans at the end of. Uh, 2000, well, in the spring of 2023. And the first thing you should notice is this is really, really a gorgeous stroller with a rose gold of, um, with the rose gold legs and the brown leather red handlebar. And it's just a gorgeous stroller. Um, I also do a full review of the Savix Koya on the channel. I'm gonna put a link to the description below. Let me show you how this quickly folds down. So what you do is you push the little button on the, t on the back, squeeze on the top, and this folds down like this. And then there's a little carry handle which you pull like a little rip, rip cord, and now it folds really small. Under 15 pounds fit in the overhead compartment of an airplane. Um, it latches on the side, you'll just unlatch it. You push, you squeeze, and it opens back up. So that's how you fold it down. So comparing that to something like a Nuna Travel, the Travel works with a Nuna car seat. This works with Cybex car seat, so that's the difference. Um, the Travel is the easiest to fold. Right, that's the whole folding thing. It takes two seconds. So if you're looking for convenience for folding, the travel is the way to go. Um, I'm gonna actually fold this up so we can do different sort of comparisons of size. So if you're looking at sizing, you can see that the Koya is smaller than the travel. It is like 17 by 18, and this is actually 28 by 18. So the, the um, travel does fit in some um, overhead compartments, not all overhead compartments. This is going to fit in a lot more. Now, in terms of the butterfly, you, uh, the butterfly is also super, super popular. Works perfectly with the Bugaboo Turtle Air by Nuna. Um, has integrated footrest. Um, I love the way this looks. This is extremely popular, like I said, and it folds down just like that. And then in terms of um, the size, it's just about the same size. The, um, the butterfly has a very tall seat height. It's 22 inches high. And the actual stroller is 22 inches long versus, like I said, around, what did I say before, like 20, 19, 20 inches long for the Koya. Oh, let's just see how big the seat height is, the seat back is of the Koya as well. So let's open this up. I'd have to measure that, so I'm, I'm curious myself, so we'll all learn together. The seat height for the Koya is 19 inches. So there's three more inches on the butterfly than there is on the Koya. Let's keep moving. Squeeze open, and it pops open. Like I said, I do a full review of the butterfly, all of these different strollers um, on the channel. The ubiquitous and very, very popular Baby Zen Yo-Yo 2. Um, you can get this with a bassinet. You can use this as a travel system with lots of different popular car seats. You can get a zero pack for it. So there's lots of flexibility that you, and you can even add a connect second tandem piece to this. Um, to fold this down, you fold underneath here, you fold underneath there, and it folds nice and small. Again, we'll fold this again. What you do is you just push this down and then you pull. Okay. Um, those are like pretty similar in terms of size. 17, 18 inches. Is the number changing every time I measure? Drop a comment below. And let me just flip it over. I was measuring it this way last time. And then we have it like, again, 19-ish inches. This is about 22 inches wide, long and 17 inches deep. So this is like smaller than a yo-yo. That's a pretty big deal. I think it's a big deal. In the baby world, that may be a big deal. But again, I think that these are, you know, the yo-yo is a tried and true product. Let's grab a Bump Rider Connect 3. So the Bump Rider Connect 3, again, of all the strollers, this is the only one that can take two of these strollers, click them together, and turn it into a side-by-side um, -side double stroller. Turns into two full double strollers. Um, also, this is the only stroller that is a full recline for newborn out of the box. And um, you should definitely check out my review of the Bump Rider Connect 3 on the channel um, to fold this down. It folds very similar to a yo-yo fold underneath like there, but it's a little bit easier. Just pull right here and this folds down. So um, in terms of the size, this is about 19 inches wide. So the width is, this is like fifth, um, this is 18 inches, a little bit an inch um, 
wider and this is about 23 inches long. So again, also fits in the overhead compartment airplane. This one will fit in more overhead compartments, you know, but also this overhead compartment of an airplane thing is kind of funny because it also depends on the flight, the size of the plane, um, how crowded the flight is, how much room there is for business travelers, et cetera, because as unfortunately, the airlines prioritize business travelers over families. Get it together, airlines. We, it's really hard to travel with kids. Okay, and then finally, we have the Upper Baby Menu. So the Upper Baby Menu only works with an Upper Baby Mesa in terms of a travel system. So fold it down, it folds like this. There's a carry strap, so this also has a strap. And it, in terms of the length, the width, the wheels width is the determinants of the width of this. This is about 20 inches wide and about 23 inches deep. So again, I think these are all gonna be great for travel. Um, things to consider are um, what car seats are compatible with them, um, which are have like newborn cap 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 capabilities, which ones don't have newborn capabilities, and then of course, the look. Like I said, I do a full review of these strollers on the channel, and I do a full roundup of the best Lightweight like Strolls of 2023. I'll put a link below. Check that out. And I hope this was helpful. Um, if you want your own personalized consultation, go to mbeans.com slash consultations and you can do a virtual consultation from anywhere in the country or you can visit us here in Magic Beans in Wellesley, Massachusetts, right in the outskirts of Boston. And I hope you like the video and maybe you'll watch some more. So I will see you at another video.